Hey everybody, welcome back to Monster Hunter Rise. Sky here. So, we're going to be using the same loadout that we did in the previous episode. However, I do want to change the switch skill to the sliding slash. Because I tried using the other one and it just seemed so normal. Oh, and I outfitted them in really, really warm clothes because we're going to the Frost Islands and I don't want them to feel cold. Uh, we're going after... Just to remind everybody, faceless foe, Hunter Keizo. So gross there I was taking a rest when something wet dripped on my shoulder. I looked up and ew, wrinkles, veins, and ick. A pale monster with no face that looks like a... Looks like a what though? What does it look like? Does it fly? That could be a wing on its side. I, I'm hoping that it's not some kind of flying thing that... Because I'm going out there with a the sword and shield. If it is a flying thing, I'm, I'll have to go back to the storage and, uh, and equip my bow. But it's fine. Look at how warm they look. <laughs> Gathering points are spawn. Let's do that because the sword and shield does bounce quite a bit. Speeds that up, that'll be good as well. Nothing that I really want. That might be good. But body growth sounds good. I feel like just an EXP boost for them. It's just it's just naturally good. Let's do that. We're gonna we're gonna get health um, and whatever buff for eating anyway. So. I wonder what's in that cup. Is it tea? It looked green and like... It looked like the stuff that, that Michael drinks in GTA 5. Like that Hulk stuff. You know, like a Hulk smoothie or something. Oh, damn. What in the hell? Oh, my God. <laughs> Hello. My god. What a monster. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh, I didn't do the... Um, didn't do the, the item transfer. Restock. What happened to my other trap? Did I mistakenly use it? I think I might have. Just used it by mistake. Unless it's here somewhere. Now it's not really the time to be doing all of this, but... What do I need? So I'll use the Might Seed here. I think that'll be good. I have some bombs as well.
I wonder, once you get that one, does that mean that there's nothing else? And there's no point in... Really? Really? I feel like that's a weird mechanic in the game. They just go to the end and it's done. It's over. Which way am I going? There is a white bug here. I'm trying to remember where where eleven takes you back out to. Like, is it like that cave just above where six is? That like water cave? Let's try. Well, he is going now to 10, but I think it will be um, good to know for the future. So the next time that we, we need to be going down into those bottom caves, we know exactly what we're doing. Yep. And it is correct. So this should take me like down to 11. Yep. Nice. We are learning. My God, there he is. I don't like this thing. Easily the most disgusting thing that we've seen so far. My god. No. Did I bounce off because... No. God damn it. Oh, thanks. This guy just has the most annoying attacks. His head, neck area definitely does take more damage. But now I'm afraid of it because there's like lightning there. Into the wall with you. That could have been better. Damn it. 
Okay, so... The damage he takes in his head and neck area is actually a lot more. Like, it's not a small increase. God damn, I, I saw it too late. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. I know you put that out for me. Okay. So what does that el electricity do? My assumption would be that it messes with your stamina or something. Okay, so it's good. They're gonna fight. Jesus Christ, that was close. That was a quick attack. Can I, can I please? Can I please? Can you guys? Don't come to me. Go there. Happen to the music. <clears throat> kind of weird fighting this thing with no music. Also makes it a bit more eerie. Oh my god. I don't know, this thing is just fucking weird, man. I don't like it. It's weirding me out. Even its movements. Okay, I know that it's hurt now, but and that's why it's moving like that. But still, like stop being so weird, dude. Hi. So he's going all the way. Let's get these. So now he's going to be underground.
I think the the um, battle between him and the Acne song. What did I do? No, no. <laughs> Stop that. The battle between him and the Acne song that allowed me to get um, the, the Acne song down so that I could ride it and have another battle with them. I think that helped a lot to speed this up. But I have to say, this is one weird, weird monster. Yeah, let him fight those guys. Why are you coming to me, dude? I almost killed you. Wow, I didn't have my weapon out, so I wasn't able to do the thing that I was actually trying to do. Oh. What the hell? Dude, come on. If, if it wasn't weird, oh, oh my god, no. If it wasn't weird enough already, this motherfucking thing, ah oh no, I don't like this. Please stop. Yeah, thank you. Yes. You're dead. Good fucking riddance, honestly. The world does not need you or whatever you came from. God damn this thing. <laughs> I, I did not expect this thing to be some weird gelatinous. It, it looks like it's wet. Not right now, because it's dead and like we're indoors, but when it was outside, it looked like it was wet and slimy and like had really smooth skin. Either way, at least he's down. But goddamn. That one takes the top spot for the ugliest so far. Ugh. Broken parts, pale extract, ugh, flab ugh, flabby hide and pale extract. <laughs> it's, it's disgusting. I wonder what you make. So, oh, so those shock weapons that I was seeing, that's probably how you get those. And honestly, if this was real life, cutting off that thing's hide and using it as armor, I would never, I would never do that, ever. I'm interested to see though. It's, it's shiny and it's smooth. Oh, fucking hell, that no. I don't like that. Just you. It's like a gimp suit. What does it give you? Recovery speed, focus and slugger. Thunder attack. More runner. It's only one thunder attack though. Uh, let's see. So we need a light crystal before we can make it. Okay, that looks fucking dope actually. That looks cool. If we get a light crystal, we might do that. I'm just trying to think. Okay, so that mud monster that we encountered, but we, we didn't kill yet. This guy. No, it's not him. Yeah, this one. Um, What element would he be? Because there's no earth element, because you would expect that he would be an earth element, right? 
So out of the other elements, I think we can see elements here. There's fire, water, thunder, ice and dragon. So I expect that he's a water. That's my next best assumption. So in order to counter water, we'd probably use thunder, right? So before getting him, I would like to make this. So get a light crystal, make this and use this to take him down. And a light crystal. A light crystal. Does it drop from anything or is it just something that you pick up? I'd expect it's something you pick up, right? This entire time I could have just come here. So I know that I need an ice claw. Capture walls, target walls. Hmm. It's a bit weird. I would have expected that capture reward would be higher for certain things. Oh, the ear. Okay. So if I want an ear, I either need to break the parts or capture it. Okay. Not that I need the ear right now, I need the ice claw, but just good to know. Um, we won't do this just yet. Let's do one of these. Have I killed a lot, Roth? I don't think so. I think I have a optional quest for the Sandy Plain, so let's do one there. Let's do a flooded forest, so let's do this one. Um, we'll, we'll use the same loadout, or should we do a bow? Ah, I didn't save the bow one. Let's just go with this. We'll make sure that nobody wants to speak to me. Um, do -do -do. Restock. That can go away. I should actually just stop using regular potions because I have so much of honey, I just make mega potions. What else do I do? I think might be useful. Let's make three of those. Because I do use them often, but they, it's slowly getting to the point where it's kind of useless to use them. Oh, that might be the next one up. Um, yeah, because the um, the bombs, the our weapons are, are are slowly getting to that point where the bombs are but too weak. I love this map. Still think the flooded forest is the best aesthetically so far, but this one is really damn close. Cause I love how, you know, this this there's like kinda of some ruins as well. Like mining deposits, things like that. Oh damn, there's a barrel at that side. I'm not going there. I could actually just kill this guy.
Aggressive all of a sudden. He's a bit preoccupied, preoccupied. Getting his rock and shit. Right button. Damn. He turns really fast. I'm interested in these things on the wall up here. Like, what are those? He's like almost dead already. He's gonna go up there, that Barrett is gonna fucking kill him. Um, so what are these? Huh. Is it so that maybe I can... He went the other way. So can you like throw a kunai at them and then they'll help you in the fight. Not help you, but just like rain down some of those um, ranged bullets or whatever they are. Is this where I want to be? I don't think so. I still haven't encountered a, I believe it was a rock lizard again. Oh, there we go. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I'm too quick for my own good. I was supposed to take a picture of it. For that side quest. Now we know there's one east of two, if I remember. These guys are fighting. Yep, take me to wherever you're going. So we can kill you.
There we go. Definitely doesn't put up much of a much as much of a fight as a lot of the other monsters. But when he does attack, he attacks. Are you guys just gonna like snuff me or what's going on? No! No, no, no. You will let me carve. Can you guys please handle this? It's one little dude. You guys got this. God damn it. Bobble cactus is what I need. I believe I made all of the, the jaggy armor, but I might need it for some weapons as well. The rounded skeleton is good. I didn't mean to do that actually. I wanted you. So they are they like very particular about this cactus? There we go. Okay, sometimes when they say it's like on a spot, um, it's not always on that spot. It's just like in that area, there might be some that spawns. I wonder if it's one of those or if it's one of those where it's like you have to get all 10 from specific spots. I don't see this other green. Let me do a uh, double check because if I leave and it really is only on these specific spots, then I'm gonna have to come back. It doesn't look like there's anything unless it's down there. Yep. What is this? Toad. Cool, so they're like just basically telling me exactly where they are. Can I attack this? No. Hi. 
think this is the first time that we've killed one of these monster guts. Bauble cactus. Oh, just one more. And we are done. Cool. Oh damn, I didn't take off his warm clothes. He must have been feeling so hot. Cool. Because I do want to make that uh, affinity double blade. But I do want to make the poison one as well. But we do have the Roggy Bow, so that's poison. So maybe affinity with a double blade. Any of these that give an additional item seems more worth it than the others. So, this is the next one, the Tetranaden, um, some kind of frog thing. I wonder if it's a frog kind of monster, if it's poison. Let's see here. I don't think they would have this be poison and this as well. It could be paralysis, maybe? Just trying to think, because if this one is like mud. And the reason why, uh, okay, it says it here as well, but I, I saw one of the leg pieces when, when crafting mentioned that it's easier to walk around in mud. Um, sometimes caused by monsters and stuff so, and and this thing was like spewing up mud spongy oasis so that's the next one what build are we gonna do against it Critical stuff. I, I have to say, this thing's weapons do have a good aesthetic to them. For how ugly that fucking monster is. Oh damn, 20 thunder and 8 paralysis and 10 affinity. That is huge. Like, look, like, just compare that to this 10 poison same base attack but there's just like extra and the the sharpening is so high as well that is like really good i might do that and then go where would i go with the switch axe because 23 thunder yeah that's good but i mean it's not as good as like for the same materials or similar materials i guess flabby hide Electro sack. So one flabby hide to electro sack. Hmm. I think if I had one more electro sack, I could have made both, but let's have a look at. Okay, so there is no Kulu, Kulu tree here. Yeah. 
Still don't have it. Come on. I killed like four of these things already. Well, yeah, four. Like one, one now, one in the previous episode, one as a quest and one in training. Yeah, four. And I still can't make this. I think for this monster, we'll go to back to a switch axe. We'll probably use the one that we have, which is this one it has paralysis. And in terms of crafting another switch axe, I'm not sure which route to go. The bone stuff doesn't have green sharpening though, so I don't think I would want that. Yeah, I think I'm good with this for now. There's nothing else that really screams out. We could go fire at some point. Not right now though. Uh, I'm just trying to think. So this is a big frog. We're not going to fight him in this video, but I do want to prepare a little bit. So he's in the Frost Islands. Ice resistance is always good there, but I doubt that he is. He himself is ice. I'm still so weirded out by this. God damn it. It looks so weird. Can you imagine what it feels like? It's probably one of those feelings where, where it feels wet, but then after you touch it and you touch your hand, your hand isn't wet. So you don't know why you're getting that wet feeling. Fucking disgusting. <laughs> um... That all costs Macalite all. I think let's just let's just go with our our loadout, our switch paralysis loadout. This I'd like to overwrite because we changed the switch skill, and I think I like that more. We'll just make sure our, our resistances are okay. Yeah, I mean, I doubt we're gonna run into fire in that place. It's the Frost Islands, and that thing doesn't look like it's gonna be throwing out fire or anything, so I think that's good. So the next one, yeah, we're gonna be taking on that uh, Tetranaden. So stay tuned for that. Do the whole liking and subscribing. Um, it helps me out. I don't like to ask, but ever since I have been asking, it's been happening more. So, I mean, I guess there it is. If you if you are really liking these and, you know, just enjoying chilling with me, just... Other than that, I think we're good. So, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks so much for stopping by. My name is Sky. Goodbye.